Then we turn our attention to East because Hillary is going to be a very interesting storyline for those of you in California, Arizona, even parts of Nevada and uh, into Utah will be affected by this. Last fall, you might recall that Saturday when Kay brought some heavy rain. Also brought a strong uh, east to west wind with some fire danger to the north, but some heavy rain in the parts of California. Uh, and K is on the map there. This map shows recent uh, history uh, of tropical tracks that impacted or became very close to Southern California between 1949 and 2022. And there were several of them back in the 70s. 70s were peppered by some of these storms and also the 60s as well. 1999 pops up in tw two cases too. We expect Hillary to strengthen into a category one, two, and even a category three storm. And and then it will continue to move north and gradually weaken over that cooler water uh, that is uh, adjacent to the northwest coast of Mexico and southwestern California. Uh, but this is going to be a big driver in pumping a lot of rain. Wind will be one story we have to keep an eye on, but the rain is going to be the big story here with two to four inches of rain likely in places like El Centro and uh, Yuma and Lake Havasu City. So look out there into parts of uh, areas like Imperial California. It's a big story. And we'll be watching for the risk of mudslides, road washouts, and so forth, as this is going to give a big shot in the arm to the monsoon.